Now Bob's right. If you do go back to last year, Suarez, Hater, that one-two punch. That right here in the stadium. And just an absolutely beautiful summer. We'll do the DH duties. Fernando Tatis, junior bat second. Anyway, you look at the strikeouts, 23 and 34. Not a lot of... 31. Hassan Kim gets in there, and he takes a first-pitch fastball inside. Underway, 2-8 and all-time in Detroit. That includes three losses at Tiger Stadium in the night. And now here in 2023. Mm. On 2-0, he misses again. And so 3 and nothing to Hassan under the game yesterday as Kim takes ball four and a leadoff walk here against Matt Manning. Kim at first, nobody out, and another miss from Matt Manning. A check on Kim, who has swiped 18 bags this yet to throw a strike and wow. doesn't get the call with that slider at the top of the zone. It goes 2-0, and oh. Kansas City. Fernando going to try and make it difficult on him, and another miss. Seven consecutive all the way. And Fernando takes up and in, ball four, consecutive four. We saw it last night, usually literally the center of the. Tatis and Kim take their leads, and there's the first strike of the night. In the air, foul and out of play, nothing in two. Both. Still 0-2, and, and uh, Soto loses the bat. Remember, both he and. Wow. In the dirt, ball one. I miss the old school batting donut. Yes. You don't see the do Wow. Two and two to Soto. And obviously not the ball strike ratio. Matt Manning is going. Soto hits it sharply to Abanez at second base. That's one. And a double thing. 255 with 54 runs batted in. Probably his best slider of the night so far in strike one. It might take. Machado hits it a ton but foul. Another hard hit foul ball down the line as you take a little. And that's a good fastball right at the knees for strength three call double play and a catch. Major League debut right here right now against this lineup put together by the Tiger manager. Six foot seven lefty delivers and the first pitch of his major league career. A lot of firsts. First swing first out in the big leagues. He's got a gold glove first score of the inning. Stay tuned. So in double A San Antonio 18 three passes. Those are the kinds of numbers that'll get you promoted. And Torkelson grounds it to Machado. A couple of course left-handed batter for him to face. And a ground ball to second base. There's Cronenworth. And a 1-2-3. Andrew Bogarts will lead off against Matt Manning. And he takes a first pitch slider for a called strike. In a perp. Xander shoots that one. Out behind second base. Option of that first inning. Talked to Jake before the game, Jesse. And he said that uh, hopefully some of those... Uh Five triples this year to lead the team. If you go back to his major league debut in 2020, only both. Um, hold on. <laughs> uh, uh, give me the uh, initial. The last Cronenworth. And Jake hits that one slowly to the right side. And starting back-to-back -back games for the first time since coming back off the injured list. Ended up requiring surgery. All fans to exit the seating area and take cover on the concourse. <laughs> Got him. Second straight inning. Matt finishes the Padres with a really big, thick raindrops right now that are. Game will continue for now as Jackson Wolf goes back to work in his major league. Oh. The weather here at Comerica Park. Nice yeah. breaking ball and one and one. Yeah, he's done it at every level ever since inning. Yeah, four pitches to get three outs. Veerling flew out. He's got shoulder fatigue as this one's to right field. And for an even if you don't start, start one. You, you, or me. Well, who's got the, who's got the bigger head? Out right there, right? I can't tell. You're very far away in here. Javier Baez. Oh, and a big hop to Hassan Kim. This guy, six foot seven. And a good breaking ball for strike one to McKinstry. Gotta love it. You know what? I think, uh, but it's nothing like standing in there. Oh, he got squeezed on that one. Good pitch. Definitely a funky delivery, yeah. kind of herky jerky, the arm angle. Look at. Kind of quick from the backside, all the way out front. One of just a couple handfuls of guys in Major League history. So you're Jackson Wolf, 24 years old. 
2 and 0. Oh. It's great. <laughs> Gets a call there. 2 and 1 to Miggy who runner goes, Cabrera hits it sharply and through the left side a base hit. Rogers, the Tiger catcher. He's hit in six straight, one out of four with Detroit. Had a kid, make a pitch right here. Brent watching. And he just gets a piece. That's a line drive into right field, and that'll be the first run that he's allowed. It's one ball and one strike after what is officially. And that's out of play, one and two. Little bit away, two balls and two strikes. Just short. And again, a foul ball back out of play. Padres draft. Mm. Gets a piece. The other thing you might be noticing about him is that he lined in his center field, and that'll get down in front of Grisham. Lead off in the bottom of the first against Wolf. Swings at the center. That's a base hit. Shorts on his. You know, Jesse, you and I had a chance to talk with A.J. Hinch before the game, and he really likes the dynamic of this. The walked and struck out more than any other Tiger. Yearling was on the move from first base. He'll have to go back. Ticked up this year, certainly. And now two balls and two strikes. You're just tuning in, but that's oh! when it didn't get out, you could just see how deflated he became, and it was almost like I love the idea that an outfielder has a chance to snatch one back. Right pitch mix. Slider and four seam fastball pretty much even. Neck and neck. Three and two to Trent Grissom with the top of the order coming up. This night doesn't get out, I don't think, with last year's dimension. So right off the bat in our uh, abacus as well as my compass and what i came up with was what you're seeing here today of watering an infield or maybe making it harder uh to, if you think you have a speedy team or young offensive players and for their money right now they feel like this park is still despite you know they had a team ground ball pitchers right so around home plate it was very soft it's an angler for the first time after angler's evening began with a 10 pitch walk to Trent Tigers with a three nothing lead as Kim sends this McKinstry in and Luis Fernando big rip at a slider nothing in one moving over towards the line beyond the dive of Javier Baez sends that one sharply into left field and a base hit Grissom rounding third Skies that have gone in front on another original wall here in left field at Co That's a foul tip held Robert Suarez now back in the mix for the Padres a little bit of a different uh, equation there Cronenworth 